Welcome back to Top 4 Repairs. In this topic, I'm going to show you guys how to fix P00A7 fuel rail system pressure too low. So if you're getting P00A7, it means that fuel pressure is too low in the fuel system. This can be caused by a lot of things. If you're getting low fuel pressure, the first and most important thing you should always check is fuel leaks. Fuel leaks can occur anywhere. It can occur right at the schrader valve, it can occur right at the line. The line can start to become brittle, it can break, it can kink. Fuel leaks can also occur right at the sill or gasket. It can leak right at the fuel line connection. It can leak right at the fuel filter area. It can leak at the fuel pump and so on. The next reason why you're getting P00A7 is due to either a faulty fuel pressure regulator or a faulty fuel pressure sensor. The fuel pressure sensor is most likely mounted on the end of the fuel rail and it is uh, electronically controlled. The next reason why you're getting P00A7 code is because your fuel pump is failing. Now there are two different types of fuel pump. You have a low pressure fuel pump and you have a high pressure fuel pump. This fuel pump is a low pressure and there's also another fuel pump which is the high pressure fuel pump and normally is mounted on the valve cover area. The next reason why you're getting P00A7 is because you have a gasoline problem. For example, your gasoline could be contaminated. Either there's dirt in it or there's water in it or maybe there's too much rust in the gasoline. It's very unlikely there'll be rust in the gasoline but it can happen. The most likely problem is you're going to have water or dirt in the gas tank. The next reason why you're getting that code is because maybe there's a blockage somewhere in the fuel system. You could have a blockage in the fuel line, you could have a blockage right at the fuel filter, you could have a blockage right at the fuel pump strainer, and so on. What symptoms are you most likely to encounter when you have low fuel pressure? The first symptom you're going to encounter is going to be an engine misfire. The next issue is going to be a starting issue. You're either going to experience a no start, hard start, or it can take a few attempts for your engine to start. Just because you're getting P0087 code does not mean that your problem is actually permanent. Sometimes it can actually be a glitch. For example, if you're driving uphill and you have less than a quarter of gas in the gas tank, when you're driving uphill, this fuel pump is going to tilt slightly. And when the fuel pump tilts slightly, maybe the fuel pump did not suck up enough gas because you have so less gas in the gas tank and this can trigger that code P0087. The next symptom is going to be poor engine performance. You're going to notice lack of power, your engine may shudder while driving, and your engine may actually turn off due to low fuel pressure. I hope you found this video useful. As always, thanks for watching and subscribe to Top 5 Repairs.